Shalom, friends in Christ. Welcome back to our channel. If you are yet to subscribe to this channel, please, do so now, and turn on the full notification bell, so you won't miss our next video. In these video, we will be sharing with you all, a message from our Lord Jesus Christ. To Seer Enoch, received on December 24, 2014. Before we begin, let us pray briefly for the grace of discernment. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. O Lord, please teach us how to respond to the leadership of the Holy Spirit. Let us be prayerful, and sensitive, so that we can understand every instruction that the Spirit offers. Make us a sensitive servant that listens to the voice of the Holy Spirit, and make us an obedient servant, that yields to his instructions. Let our obedience benefit your kingdom. Let us never regret serving you, but help us to prosper in this life, and in heaven also. For in the name of Jesus Christ, we pray. Amen. Brothers and sisters, it is advised that we learn to share heaven's message immediately after watching it, to at least one person. The aim of this, is to help increase the reach of this message to more people. God bless you all, as you watch this message to the end. Our Lord Jesus began. Peace to you. Sheep of my flock. During the time of my adversary, all the technology of this world will be at his service. Already, trial runs, and installation into electronic apparatus is underway of technologies, which will emit waves into the brain to modify human behavior. By means of those telephones that you call cellular, all my adversary's malice and deception will be spread, that being of iniquity will communicate holographical with humanity, by means of the cellular, and all technology will be used to subjugate the human population. My children, the evil use of technology is robbing the soul of my youths, and it will be they who are the most vulnerable in the time of my adversary, because the young are more prone to use this technology of death. During the time of the New World Order, all technology will be used to manipulate the human will. Big Brother, as this technology will be called, will take control of the mind of all those that use it. Electromagnetic waves, charged with spiritual venom, will make all the persons who use these technologies to act in counter to their wills. They will act as zombies, and savage wild beasts. They will be handled like marionettes. Subliminal messages will affect the cerebral waves, reducing the users of this technology into guinea pigs. All of this technology, which is about to come out into the market, has the purpose to manipulate the human will. Big Brother will enslave the immense majority of humanity. You will be spied upon, day and night, without being aware of it. You will be tracked, wherever you are. And if someone attempts to rebel, his or her brain will be electrocuted to death. Remember, that in the time of my adversary, all will be managed with the microchip. I tell you this, so that you understand everything. Satellite technology is being tested to serve the interests of my adversary during his time. Holographic figures with spiritual images will be projected in the firmament. My adversary will display himself as the Christ and Messiah to the Catholics, Jews, and Christian world. As Buddha for the Orientals, Krishna for the Hindus, and as Mohammed to the Muslims. The holographic images will move, and speak, and the immense majority of humanity will fall for the deception. They will render cult and honor to my adversary as if he were God. Listen to my word. He will work great prodigies. So great, as to make fire descend from the sky onto the earth, in the sight of men. They will give power to the statue of the beast, even to the point of making it talk, and having it slay all those who would not adore it. My children, prepare. Because the days of anguish are near. Remember that all these are the deceptions of my adversary, and his agents of evil to get you killed. See, I forewarn you, so that when this happens, you will not render cult to the beast. And if you do, you will be eternally lost. Seal yourselves with my blood and hide in my wounds. Take all spiritual contamination to the wound in my left hand, and do not accept the mark. 
Neither should you use the technology of death that is about to come, for it will be at the service of my adversary. Seal with my blood, again, I say to you, televisions, computers, telephones, cellular, radios, transistors, and all the gadgets my adversary can use to filter his voice to you. Remember, that you will be a sheep in the midst of wolves. Therefore, be as meek as doves, and as astute as serpents. Do not get separated from our two hearts, so that you may be able to arrive safely to the gates of the new creation. My peace, I leave you. My peace I give you. Repent and convert, for the kingdom of God is at hand. Your teacher and shepherd, Jesus, the good shepherd of all times. Make known my messages to all humanity.